find sin 225 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 225 now you should check 225 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 225 lies between 180 and 360 this is 180 into 1 this is 180 into 2 okay next now 225 is close to which number this is close to 180 so 225 now should be written as 180 plus 45 so this will become sine in place of 225 now we should write this 180 plus 45 this is your step 1 next sine in place of 180 now I write 1 into 180 plus 45 next here we have 180 so sine is not going to change it will remain sine and inside we get 45 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 1 and 1 is odd and all the odd multiples of 180 they lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have plus that means angle lies in the third quadrant and in the third quadrant sign is negative so we should put negative so negative sin 45 is 1 by root 2 this is our answer